Welcome back to the GCP Mindset channel. Today we have a topic that everyone has probably already dealt with, vaccines. So what are vaccines and what do they do? Since Corona, more and more people have been interested in how vaccines actually work. We will start with some basics and we'll come back to this topic in another video about the differences in actual COVID-19 vaccination. So let's start. What everybody, really everybody should know. What is a vaccine? A vaccine is a biological or synthetic preparation that provides active acquired immunity to a particular infectious disease, for example, influenza. The acquired immunity protects the patient from the disease. It's not the vaccine itself that helps the patient, it's the body's reaction to the vaccine that protects one from getting sick from the infection. Vaccines reduce the risk of getting a disease by working with the body's natural defenses to build protection. When a patient gets a vaccine, the body responds with a reaction by the immune system and starts producing antibodies. These antibodies recognize and destroy any of the microorganisms associated with the specific vaccine the patient may encounter in the future. The scientific consensus is that vaccines are a very safe and effective way to fight or even eradicate infectious diseases. One important point in looking at vaccines is that the immune system recognizes vaccine agents as foreign and destroys them, but it remembers them for future immune reactions if a real infection occurs. Vaccines are the most effective method of preventing infectious diseases and can be used to prevent more than 20 life-threatening ones. Immunization currently prevents two to three million deaths every year from diseases like diphtheria, tetanus, pertussis, influenza, measles, just to name a few. And it's an important tool in the fight against COVID-19. Vaccines can be prophylactic or even therapeutic. Cancers caused by viruses such as hepatitis B or HPV can be prophylactically prevented with a vaccine. Some therapeutic vaccines used in cancer treatments can keep the cancer from coming back, stop a tumor from growing or spreading, or even help to destroy cancer cells. Sometimes vaccines aren't as effective or may even cause side effects, but the industry safeguards in place today with testing and timelines reduce these risks as much as possible. Vaccines are developed extensively through several phases of clinical trials and in specific patient populations, making them safer than ever. In our next video, we will dive deeper into the world of vaccines and we'll explain the different types. See you next time.